welcome to Indus News coming to you from our studios in Lahore. I am Fiza Jamal. These are the top stories of this hour. At least 42 people have been killed in US-led coalition airstrikes on the last ISIS holdout in eastern Syria. A war monitor said 13 civilians, including three children, were also killed in the airstrikes targeting homes in the Deir Azor province. Next, U.S. and Taliban have agreed to hold another round of talks after making significant progress on vital issues in Qatar. Special Envoy Zalmay Khalilzad said that the final agreement must include an intra-Afghan dialogue and a comprehensive ceasefire. Meanwhile, U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo said that Washington is serious about pursuing peace in Afghanistan and bringing forces home. Pakistan has termed the development a major diplomatic victory, saying the Taliban agreed to the negotiations only due to Islamabad's efforts. Meanwhile, eight ISIS Khorasan militants have been killed in US-led coalition drone strikes in eastern Afghanistan. Afghan military said that the drone strikes targeted ISIS hideouts in Nangarhar province. Moving on, in a fresh violation of the line of control, Indian forces have injured three civilians in Azad Kashmir. A government official said Indian troops targeted civilian population in Tatapani Goi sector of Kotli district during the intense five-hour firing. Meanwhile, a complete shutdown is being observed in Indian-occupied Kashmir to remember the 27 martyrs of the 1994 Kupwara massacre. In another development, Hezbollah has threatened to bomb Tel Aviv in response to Israel's strikes in Syria. In an interview, Hassan Nasrallah said that resistance axes, including Hezbollah, Iran and Syria, might retaliate against Israel. Nasrallah warned that Hezbollah has rockets that can strike deep into Israel. And 27 people have been killed and 77 others wounded in twin bombings at a church in southern Philippines. Security officials said that mostly civilians were killed in the attack, while seven soldiers were also among the dead. The first bomb went off inside the church on Holo Island, while the second exploded in the car parking. 